Working with PDFs on an iPad isn't actually that hard. Say, for example, you've been asked to turn in a PDF to ManageBack. Simply open the Google Doc or Pages file, go to Send a Copy. From this menu, you cannot see what you need to do, so click Open In. Then you'll get a new menu, and you might not be able to see Google Drive. If you can't see Google Drive, scroll all the way over, add Google Drive to the menu. You should only have to add Google Drive once. After you've selected Google Drive, it will upload to your Google Drive folder as a PDF. And then, if you go to your Manage Back account in Safari, not the mobile app, then you'll be able to click Upload. You can click the search button to search only for PDFs, and then upload your document. One of the great things about an iPad is how easy it is to write just like it's a piece of paper. So why not annotate our PDF? Here we can see it done side by side on an iPad and a Mac. On the Mac, we'll open the PDF in preview, and on the iPad, we'll use Exodo. In this example, we'll open from Google Classroom in both cases. On the left side, we can export as a PDF, and on the right side with the iPad, we will click Send a Copy. When we get the Send a Copy, we'll use the Open In button on the bottom and choose the Exodo app directly. This will open it as a PDF in that app. On the Mac, we will simply open our new PDF in Preview and use our annotation tools, and then resave. On the iPad, we will use the various annotation tools in Exodo, and then use the Open In button to save back to Google Drive. From there, we can simply go to Manage Back on the web, select Google Drive, and upload our PDF. Easy, on a Mac or an iPad. If you've got more questions about iPad workflow, let me know.